Hi everybody, I'm Paul Tran. Welcome to Learning Unplugged, the place to come for acoustic music and acoustic learning. What we mean by acoustic learning is learning with no technology, just the camera that's pointing at me right now. What we do on Learning Unplugged is we take a look at some simple, effective models that help us think and do things differently. So let's put the SAS away. Today we're looking at a really good customer service model, really straightforward and effective this one. It's from a lady called Sandra van der Merwe, and it is van der Merwe's customer activity cycle. Three simple stages to help you be ready, able, and in the future able to work with your customers. So let's start off with the first stage, and this is what Van der Merwe calls the pre-stage. This is where we raise awareness of our product or our service. We get our media, our social media, our website together. We get testimonials if need be. And what we're doing at this stage is we're reinforcing our customer's decision to buy from us. And at this stage, what's really helpful is when we make it easy for them to buy from us too. That's the pre-stage. The second stage is what Van der Merwe calls the during stage. This is when we're doing the work. This is where we do what we, we say we're gonna do, and we do it really well. And we may alter what we're doing because we're communicating constantly and effectively with our customers. And because we're listening, we're always happy to modify when it helps. And that's the during stage. The third stage is the post stage. This is when we've done some work and because of that, we've got a deeper understanding of what our customers really need and how their needs can constantly change. We keep listening. We always determine what they really value because you only really know that once you've started working with somebody. And because of that, we've got that deeper understanding. We start to develop better, deeper solutions with that customer knowledge in mind. And this is the stuff that keeps the relationship going. It makes sure that our customers just come straight back to us because they don't need to go anywhere else. That's the post stage. Now, if we look at this as a cycle, as it's meant to, at the top, we've got the pre-stage, we move to the during stage, and then we go to the post stage. All three stages are equally important. Now, some people say to me, well, this is just common sense, surely. Have a think about what you're doing right now. What more could you do at the pre-stage to make you really attractive and easy to buy from? What more can you do during the during stage to do even better for your customers? And then the post stage, once you've finished a job or a project, what can you learn? How can you communicate that to your customer so they're assured that you're gonna give them an even better service? It's a really simple model. It's one I use all the time. I use it when I'm working too. Let me know what you think in the comments below. And if you wanna, any requests for future learning and plugs, drop them below too. Always interested to hear those. And if you want to have a look at more Learning Unplugs, take a look at the website, ptps.co.uk, or the YouTube channel, which is Paul Tran Trainer. Enjoy the customer activity cycle. Let me know how it works for you. And I'll see you on the next Learning Unplugged.